I see you, dear. I see you, dear. Um, I'm just going to get with it. Because <laughs> I can't fix the sound. Uh, it's the only microphone that I have, so I'm sorry that I sound weird. It's being micro chunks. What? Oh, that's so weird. I don't know how to fix that. Um, I have no idea how to fix it. I'm sorry. Audio. Stereo. Yeah, none of the settings mean anything to me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna have to push ahead because yeah, this is the only way I can do it. I'm sorry. Unless I just don't unbox it and I film it with a different camera and put it up onto YouTube. But I just feel like streaming it's a way more effective use of my time. Okay, so woo, let's unbox the thing. This is the beautiful box. It is very nice. If this is a uh, like it's, it's actually really nice. Like, I can show you that there's like silver foils, which is pretty awesome. I can actually hold it here so you can see as well. Um, it, I'm impressed with this packaging so far. As a previous, let's just be, um, let's just be oddly quiet. <gasps> uh, can you hear me? I'm talking. Um, I have previously been a very big Apple fan, and so, uh, I judge packaging. I judge, pa I judge packaging harshly, and this packaging is beautiful. Okay, so it's got this little rip tab here, which I'm pretty into. It's pretty cool. Yoga book height. Sup, Lenovo. Okay, so I'm gonna take that off. And so this, I believe, is it's just a belly band that provides a little bit more information about what it is. Yoga book Windows, obviously. Um, and this one is kind of like specifically like here creativity kind of focused. Um. So this comes with a pencil, pen, pen. I'm not sure what it's called. Um, and a pen, I'm pretty sure. And it has this cool halo cable, a halo keyboard that like lights up, which is pretty amazing. It's very thin and it's pretty awesome battery life. So let's get in there and let's see what's in the box. What's in the box? Then Lenovo comes to make it less quiet. <laughs> it's not, I'm not a super popular streamer. I'm sorry, Lindsay. <laughs> It's got another little thingy in here, a little a cute little Lenovo sticker, which I'm also super into. It's kind of cool. It's like everything's branded. Good job. Good job. I'm into it. Okay, so I'm presuming now that this will just lift off. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a hinge. So it's gonna. Da! I'll do it again. Da! Okay, um, so what's in the box? It's pretty nicely laid actually. I'm gonna try and do it this way so that you guys can see. Um, this is the device itself, so in plastic. Oh, it's so nice. Look at the look at the hinges. The hinges are actually beautiful. I don't know how this where this wants to focus, like where does it best focus? Like is it all the way back here? I don't actually know. The camera's a bit average, I'm sorry. Maybe I show you here. Yeah, so pretty. It's so small. Clip the hell a moment. No, oh, yeah. Um, okay, so this is just gonna slide off, which is actually pretty nice. It does actually have a little rip tab though. Those of you who've joined me for unboxings before will know I'm a huge fan of, of the tabs, but that one, that one didn't actually do anything. So that's a bit weird. But I can just slide this, so I'm just gonna slide this. I think that might've been just get it out of the box. Um, okay, so. Pretty. It's very pretty. This is it. It feels sort of like definitely like the weight of an iPad. Like it's pretty ooh, shiny. It's um, it's pretty nice. Oh, you can see me. Woo um, wow, it's it's amazing. Um, so this thing in here, if you can see up here, is like sitting in there. And so we've got. Right, draw and type. So it's pretty exciting for me as a creative streamer. Um, you can actually just draw like straight onto the screen. To straight onto, sorry, <laughs> that was not what I mean. This uh, this surface here, um, you're able to actually draw on it and it translates to the screen. So I'm really excited to give this a go. Um, I've seen lots of people working with it. I've never touched one myself, so I'm pretty excited. Um, you can kind of also see the Halo keyboard here. 
uh, not lit up obviously but um, I'm really curious about that to see kind of how it feels haptically I guess um, because yeah I'm today actually I'm gonna go and do a whole bunch of writing um, because I have a presentation to write and so I'm, I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna see uh, how it goes I'm pretty excited uh, so that's that's the tech that is the tech. Someone mistaked it for a notebook. Yeah, I can imagine this easily being mistaken for a notebook. It is teensy. Like, so teensy. Um, I'm very impressed. I am very impressed. Very cool. Um, okay, so what else is in the box? We have some plugs, I'm assuming. We've got... This is, this is, this is really nicely designed packaging. Like, I'm actually very, very impressed. Um, little box here, it's open up, it's got what I'm assuming is a charger, perhaps, the, I'm bad at tech stuff like naming things, I think it's a micro USB that, you tell me, hmm, that camera's a bit shit eh, I just think they like to be close, one day I'll invest in a sweet new camera and it'll be right, yeah, charger, pretty sure, pretty sure charger. <laughs> So these are the things that are in the box. Oh no! Jack! <laughs> I was gonna do this, but I'll give you the permissions. Um, how do I do this? How do I do this? I think I can do this. I can allow it. <laughs> no, that's not gonna work. I'm just gonna mod you real quick, Jack, and then you'll be allowed to post whatever you want. Then you can post links. <laughs> but also I'm pretty sure I will I've got the link up to post at the end, but yeah, sorry. <laughs> um, okay, so there's nothing else in this box now, I'm pretty sure. It's, but it's still really it's really nice. Like I just I'm a bit of a fan girl about the packaging and it's really nice. Sorry, yeah, Jack. Jack works all in over. <laughs> Not just randomly modding people. Oh my goodness, there's so many things in here. Look. What is this? This is oh, this is paper. This is the paper. So this is the the book. The, the, the come. I'm gonna do a bad job of explaining. I'm gonna do a bad job of explaining. But if you bear with me, remember I haven't used this yet. I'm gonna have a better job explaining it when I stream. But ah, uh, this is paper. It's actually gridded, dotted gridded paper. I don't know. If, can you see that? Maybe not. It's really nice, actually. So this kind of explains here how it works. Um, it goes and lays on top of the 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 not keyboard the, the the where the keyboard normally is in the tech. So if we imagine for a second, one moment, I'll just demonstrate. Obviously, screen, keyboard. So this actually kind of sits. I'm assuming, yeah. And then you can actually draw directly onto it and it will translate to the screen. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. That's how it works. <clears throat> Is it a good choice? Is what a good choice? I'm not sure what you're talking about. Um, I'm not 100% sure like... Oh, I see. It's like a... Okay, so it's like magnetized in. That's kind of cool. So I'm assuming you can replace these. I don't know if you have to use this paper specifically or not. Um, it just clips in like that. Fancy. I, it's, it feels and looks really nice. Like from the point of view of a designer I'm pretty impressed. Uh, and it's kind of got like crop marks in the corners to show you where the drawing surface is. So that's really cool. I'm very intrigued by this. I'm so intrigued by this whole kind of thing, to be honest. Um, so this looks like it seems to be... I don't know what this one is, actually. Oh, a little warranty and um, safety info, etc. Probably like, here's how you turn it on. Here's how you work the pen. You can use any paper, post notes, even trade from newspaper. Oh, nice. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, and also, I am guessing that this is to open, um, like for a SIM card or for some kind of opening slot. Although I've got the Windows version, I'm not sure if it can take a SIM card. I don't know much about connecting stuff to the internet. 
But was any other PC package it'd be three times the size? Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah, a little sim tool. Yeah, I assume that, I guess it can take a sim. I don't know, I suppose it's tablet. Makes sense. Anyway, so that's that. I'll just put that somewhere where I'm not gonna lose it. Um, and then the last but not leastest thing is this wee pen tool, which I'm, I'm so freaking excited about. So, okay, Sam's excited about the sim card. That makes me have hope. Oh, it slides. Oh, it slides. Ah. So, this is the piece de, de resistance, as they say. Um, the magic pen tool that you can draw with. And so it's branded. It's pretty nice looking. Does this, does this actually open? Does this come off? How does this... How does this... How does this... Hey! It just comes off like that. I just didn't want to break it. That's really cool. Um, I imagine this might get lost. I don't know. I might canvas some other users for how they've dealt with that. Oh, it does go on the end though, so that's that's at least something. Um, but my Wacom, if it had one of those, oh man, I would have lost that in five seconds. Um, desktop edition, I assume. If it was mobile, it'd be terrifying. For some, because it's not a phone. <laughs> yeah. That's for the micro US. Oh, micro SD. Oh, okay, cool. That makes perfect sense. Yeah, I wanted to go Windows because I want to run Photoshop on it, like um, the regular version of, I think. So that's why I went with Windows. But um, I don't know. I don't know much about Android entirely. Like, I feel like it would have been a huge jump for me to like move to PC and Android at once. Uh, it would have been a bit intimidating. And so in here, you've got some new nibs. Which I'm guessing are, I think they're all the same nibs, so it's not like Wacom where you've got kind of different nibs going on, it's just a one pressure sensitive nib. So that's, that's all that was in the, that's, that's the box. So, and might I just add, very impressed with the box itself. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. Just put that down here and I will lay out for you all the things that were in the box, including the product itself. There it is. Oh man, it's so pretty. Is that right up to the keyboard? Uh, chargey things, pen, a little notebooky thing, this, and of course the paper to draw with. So these are the things that you've got in the box when you buy a yoke book. I'm very excited to go and try this out. Um, if anyone has one and wants to give me some tips. I did the peeling off the plastic bit, I'm sorry, I'm pretty sure. I think I've done it. Let me just double check. Because it didn't actually come with plastic on uh, this. It came with a piece of film in between. So it came with um, with this instead. So I can, I can kind of reenact it for you. There you go. <laughs> it was initially stuck to it. There's nothing on the screen. There's no, uh, no film on the screen. Sorry fam. Sorry fam. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that is the yoke book. Um, thank you for joining me. I'm so excited to give this a go. Like I said, I'm gonna go and do some writing on it today. The keys are flat, yes. So I'm gonna test out that haptic feedback, um, how it feels to type with. It definitely seems like a machine that's made for um, creative pursuits. So sketching and drawing and such, but um, I think it's gonna be good for traveling around and, and typing in many locations, which is what I like to do. Um, also, in case anyone didn't know, I just realized it can be like this, um, which is freaking cool. Like, I think the people who know lots about Lenovo and yogas and stuff know this, but this blows my mind. Like it can just bend completely around. What? What? First set up stream. I'm nervous about setting it up to be honest because I am bad at PC but I'm gonna get good I'm gonna get good and it's gonna be good um thank you so much I will stop my stream here and I'm going to post this up on YouTube so if you're watching it there thank you very much as well um and I will see you for some awesome creating with this bad boy very soon